Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Lumen Moon Tarot. So guys, I am here to do um, a random collective reading. This reading is for the collective, so it's not going to resonate with all of you, okay? Please just take what does resonate and toss the rest. You guys know the drill, right? Right? Yeah, we're pros here, man. We know what we're doing with this stuff, right? Um, yeah, do, we don't want you to force any readings into your world. So if it feels like it's not resonating with you, um, it's probably not for you. And you know what? It's okay. It is. Um, so anywho, uh, thank you everyone for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations. Um, thank you for all that you do that helps this channel keep growing. I truly, truly appreciate everything. All right, so... Um, really, Potato? Really? My cat. Hold on, guys. All right, come here. Come on, you want it? What? The door's open. Okay. Sorry, I had to help him. You know, he's, he's a grumpy boy. First thing that I'm seeing here, everybody, is, um, I, I feel like, you're doing really, really good financially. I feel like you're you're getting money coming in. She's holding hundred dollar bills, okay, with a big thumbs up. So I feel like um, I feel like you're leveling up, right? You're moving on up, uh, financially focused on your money, doing really good. You're happy. I see you being on your own out here, single, and just doing good feeling good. Your money is great right now. That's what I'm seeing here. Your money is great and people are seeing it and they're not in such good a shape here. Okay. Now look at how tattered I feel like this, this little fox is really tattered somehow. Real skinny. <laughs> look at the bug eyes, right? They're like, what the, at? like, here you are. And they're like, what? Yeah, exactly. They, they're finding out just how abundant you are right now and how happy you are. And, um, and people are stressing. They're freaking out. They don't want to see it, don't want to hear it, okay? And it's making somebody nutty. It's making them nutty, okay? It's making them, your riches are making them, <laughs> making them nutty. Yeah, they're doing a lot of thinking here, a lot of contemplating, um, yeah, this person's doing a whole lot of thinking. All right, so I figured we would do a flash reading because I really, I really dig flash readings, right? Um, you guys know, you know, yeah. Um, whoever this is, really, they're in shock. Uh, what you're? I don't know if you got like a big, huge lump sum of money. I don't know if you've just been working your butt off and it's paying off, doing something that's creative maybe. I'm seeing you in Empress energy here, okay? Very abundant, going strong. You're like, I've got this, right? Yeah, you could even have somebody new here. Um, yeah, and your person over here is miserable, miserable. And, you know, underneath this, too, they're contemplating this already. Look, look at this. Miserable, miserable, I'm telling you. I feel like a lot of people are upset and angry um, over how well you're doing, okay? You kind of have to question their, char their character at that point. If people are upset over how good you're doing, number one, they need to keep their nose out of it then. And number two, they're not that great of friends, right? Because they're upset that you're doing well. It's, yeah, and look, they're really, truly upset, angry. They could be finding out that you've got someone new here. This is someone new approaching you. I feel like they're worried that you will. If you haven't yet, you will. And that's what they're worried about because you're out here abundant, happy, glowing, high vibing, on your own, independent, and really 
doing well financially, okay? You're a little bit guarded. You're guarding your heart here. But I feel like if someone does approach you, you're going to be really, you're just glowing. Look, look at you. Who wouldn't want to date this person here? Look at how happy you look, how sweet, glowing, you know? I mean, seriously, that's what this person is. I feel like that's what they're worried about. Or maybe you already have someone new and they've seen it. Maybe pictures on a phone through the internet, um, whatever it is that you're posting. I feel like they're first angry because you're doing so well and being so abundant, right? They're upset about that. And they're thinking it's not going to be too long before somebody snatches you up. Someone new, okay? Someone new. This person's worried, sad, starved for your attention, could be dealing with an air sign. Not necessarily, though. Air, this is an elemental card in this deck, right? This is my handmade deck. Um, this is an elemental card. That means this is about them wanting to communicate, wanting to clear the air, wanting information, maybe, doing a lot of thinking. Okay, you could be an earth angel here. Yeah, someone's really upset because they know that, um, one, you're accomplishing great things. You're already doing great things. And two, you have more great things coming towards you. In earth angel energy, you can manifest kind of whatever you want here. And you're having, you're out here having a victory. I feel like that's what they hate the most, is that you're victorious. After, after all you've been through, Empress energy is no joke, man. You don't reach this level um, unless you've had so many freaking struggles. I mean, you've struggled a lot, hardcore. And you've been hurt, body slammed maybe, even on the ground, and had to build yourself up from the ground up, all on your own, with the guidance of the divine. You know, but they're out here being angry, okay, and doing a whole lot of thinking and feel feeling a whole kind of, like, sadness, right? Sadness, lack, because this is hitting them really hard. You made a huge impact on their life. This life changing. There ain't no sunshine when you're gone. This this changes things. They're, they're realizing that um, that's it. They may they may never be with you again. They some of for some of these people they may never even see you again. When I say moving up, you could actually be making a house move to a whole new location, in a nice high rise freaking pent penthouse suite somewhere for real. You're holding hundred dollar bills here. You are good, and these people whatever it is you're doing, it's making them. Their, look, their eyes are popping out of their sockets here. You're having a huge victory out here. Why? Because you are divinely led. Because you are an earth angel. Earth angel, yep. Yeah. Message. Yep. Yeah. They're going to eat their words. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. All right. What else can you show us, Divine? Yeah, you know, and that's why this, you know, this huge impact, it's because of your energy. It's because you did, you did your job. As an earth angel, I kind of see earth angels as kind of a muse, right? They, they have a, they have a primary directive, change people's lives. That's the primary directive of the earth angel. Change people's lives. You can do it with a simple word sometimes, earth angel. You've always had that skill, haven't you, person watching? It's made you stand out above everyone else, but yet get squashed more than anyone else. But you change people's lives. You inspire them. 
You make them look at themselves. And when you leave, you leave little pieces of energy, traces of you behind that they can't shake. Okay? A lot of these people want to see you down, keep you down, because there you're controlled. This is powerful energy. But when you, dis when you leave, it makes a huge impact. And some of these people aren't even aware of it until after you're gone. Okay? It's a huge hit. A hard hit. Once you pull your energy away because you're an earth angel. Because you're here to actually make them see a better way. And uh, inspire them and change their life. And you did it. And because of that, you're getting rewarded. You're getting rewarded for your struggles. You're getting rewarded for the beautiful energy that you put back into the world. Okay? And these people are out here kind of hating on that. Hating on the fact that you're happy, you're beautiful, and you're not affected by the hate. You're not affected by their hate. You're not affected by their words. You're not. You've been freed. You know why? Because you're an earth angel. And, you know, what the divine gives to you, um, no man can take away. They, these people know you probably always had really good luck. You've always been lucky. Even in hard times. The divine always came through for you, didn't they? Didn't they? It's because you're an earth angel. Yeah. And these people are upset, okay, that you're doing well. It makes people, like, they're taking notice now of your energy. Um. And it, it's, a, it's a loss, and some people handle loss differently. I think these people are angry. That's just too many, Divine. Yeah. You're free. You're a free spirit. I feel like there's a lot of people, because of your glow, because of your energy, because of how free-spirited you are, because of your beauty, uh, your happiness your high vibe, your confidence. I feel like you're a turn-on for a lot of people. <laughs> I just have to say, you're a turn-on, but I think you're just going up. You're going up. You're moving up in your life, okay? Yeah. And I feel like you have haters, and I feel like you have a particular person that's very fearful that someone else is going to find you. That someone else, you know, will give you love. And someone else will give you love. You know? It's just how it is. Um, they're trying to figure out a way to change this around. Um, I feel like they're just, there's a person out here who's screaming, clawing on the inside. And just walking around being super grumpy and gloomy on the outside. I, I feel like this is somebody who um, may be trying to manifest you back. Okay? This is the magician here. They're being quiet about it, though. They're, they haven't spoken to you. Um, you wouldn't know. Uh, they're keeping it all inside, but I feel like it, it's got to come out soon. I feel like somebody wants to tell you how they feel about you. Or there could be somebody who has a very clingy person that they can't break away from. They could be afraid that this person could um, want revenge, right? Want revenge. Honestly, I feel like somebody has fallen in love with you. I feel like it could be multiple people. I feel like all eyes are on you right now, and that's what's got this person sad. 
because there was somebody they could be with someone who's just clinging on and clinging on very codependent and you've got a lot of people watching you all eyes are on you and people are falling in love because of your energy okay um yeah i feel like this person is stuck in something i feel like they're stuck with in a karmic situation with someone very clingy possibly vengeful they could even have some borderline mental instability okay um and they're watching your person like a hawk so they feel like they can't speak to you um yeah tower moment after tower moment everything in their background is going down in flames getting destroyed yes that would be a confirmation so this person needs to be very careful but yet at the same time i'm telling you you're about to get someone new this is the new cookie it says the other guy but it can be a woman take it how it resonates it's cookies are not gender specific i i assure you cookies are not gender specific but yeah i feel like a new cookie's coming for you and they need to be careful around this person that they're with. But yet at the same time, this whoever this is, is in love with you. And they're very sad because they know other people want you to. And you are about to get someone new. Yeah, you're about because you're a healer. That's that star energy, right? Out there, like I said, being that earth angel. It's earth angel energy here. Uh, you could be an Aquarius, but yeah, I feel like this is this is what you're you're a healer. You're out here a, a spiritual healer, inspiring other people, guiding other people. What did I say? It's like being a muse, right? Muses were um, they were what nine sisters? Was it nine or eight? I don't. I think it was nine. Zeus had nine daughters, and they were muses, and they were kind of sent all around the world, right, on earth, to inspire people to go after their dreams. I don't know about you, but that sounds like an earth angel to me. So when you pull your energy back, you leave those traces of you. I've talked about it in other readings. Look back. It's your energy. It's your divinity. It's everything about you, really. And it's leaving this person absolutely dumbfounded. They're, they just, they don't know what to say. They, they're, they're amazed. I feel like you, they're amazed by you. You're amazing, okay? You're amazing. Yeah. Yeah, this person's watching you like a hawk, but they need to be careful because they're around somebody with, I feel, mental instability. I mean, that looks kind of crazy to me, doesn't it? Doesn't it look crazy? Um, yeah, this is somebody, though, who may feel betrayed and just be really vengeful and acting out, okay? And that's what this masculine is worried about. Plus, they're being watched like a hawk, okay? They're being watched. So they need to be careful, but meanwhile, they're just, they're watching you out here glow. They're watching you heal. They're watching you inspire other people. They're watching you be um, absolutely stunning and glowing, right? They're watching you be abundant. They're watching you get a new cookie, okay? And they just don't know what to do about it. They're, they're shocked. They're sad. They're shocked. They're sad. They're grumpy. And they feel trapped. Anywho, that's what I've got for this little quick reading. Um, I hope this helps. I do. And um, yeah, just know, know how very special you are. Okay? You have, you have a healing purpose here. All right, and you did your job, man. You're changing lives. If you guys like this video, please click that like button. Subscribe to my channel, right, and help me grow. We do these readings all the time. <laughs> all the time. <laughs>
<laughs> so anyway, guys, listen, know that I love you all, okay? And uh, take care of you, and peace out.